Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome back to Lemuria in Let's Play Golden Sun, The Lost Age. We're here for pretty much exactly the reason you think. Um, because I have six lucky medals, and realistically, I'm not exactly, I'm not what you would call hopeful of getting anything from here, although that might be an exception. Uh, that is particularly useful. Like, at best, I'm getting items that are worse than the things I'm about to go to the blacksmith for. Incidentally, once we're finished here, we're going to the blacksmith! So stay tuned! Oh, <laughs> uh, well, you know, a fireman's pull, that's completely different. No, realistically, the only thing, what I actually hope to get from here are a few items that I can put on the B team. That might be better for them. Particularly, uh, I'm not really having much luck in that regard, it must be said. Um, particularly weapons, because so, a lot of the, some of the armor from the endgame of Golden Sun 1 is actually really, really good. I've, I'm even wearing it, some of it on my current lead, uh, A-team party members. The, the same cannot be said for the weapons. There are no weapons from the first Golden Sun that are better than my current weapons in this game. And, in all probability, I'm gonna get better weapons when I go to the blacksmith. At least one or two. Pro and probably more. Oh, uh, well that's right in the middle. Yeah, I was sort of, somehow I was expecting that. The third set of Erebus armor. I've already sold one of those because I don't have anyone who can wear it in a useful manner. Okay, well this actually doesn't raise attack as much as your current thing. Uh, but it is actually somehow a little bit better. Um, at least for some people, it's better for Shiva. What is Shiva currently wearing on her arms? Uh, she has Spirit Gloves, Boost Elemental Power. I mean, this is probably better, to be honest. Uh, this is not going to be better defense on anyone. Nope. What? This is definitely not better on anyone. Well, it's a little higher defense for Garrett, actually, but... Two defense is not worth a loss of nine attack... Sorry, seven attack power. Flora Dress is... Not really very good. Uh, let's see... Mirror Element, no one... It, actually, a whole lot of people are wearing these right now, so this might be better on someone. Yep. It is indeed. We'll give that to Pierce, because his defense is actually a little bit low. Uh, and what are you wearing right now? Warrior's Helmet. Earth Power and Critical Hits. Definitely took that from Isaac. Might be better than the Adept Helmet, though. I mean... Technically, yes. Man, my synergy is really low. Uh, I guess that's what I get for flying here. Uh, no, I'm still forgetting just, just the... Okay, so who am I going to give this to? Because this is actually a little bit better. I could actually, I could justifiably give it to Felix, but he's so optimized for high damage that I think the extra damage is better than the plus four defense. So, Isaac would be the next best choice, but this actually lowers his defense. Uh, I'm not sure it's particularly useful on Shiva. The normalized elemental power would be better on her for sure, but plus five isn't really that big a deal. And if I'm not giving it to Shiva, then it goes, it would go to Pierce. Mm. Let's see. I mean... Only plus five elemental power is kind of not worthwhile, so we'll do it like this. And we'll give your glove to someone else. That would actually also increase Felix's defense. <laughs> okay, we'll throw this on Ivan, I guess. Yeah, he just had the... Oh. Actually, that's honestly probably better for him, because I'm using him for the... I don't know for sure if this affects healing. But I'm assuming it does. In which case, let's do this. 
you just had that shield, that j Earth resistance is better for surviving, though. Uh, you know what? I'm I'm overthinking this. Just put it on Ivan. Okay, and we're done here! Even though I get more lucky medals, I'm not coming back here again. The odds of getting... As I'm right here, I could potentially get something that is marginally better, but uh, on one party member, but the odds of that is not, are not worth the trouble of actually coming back here. Incidentally, I would have totally taken consumables in on th those particular plays, because, as previously stated, the odds of getting equipment that is actually better is not really very high. I'd be All I really got here is like one piece of equipment that was marginally- well, no, no. Two pieces of equipment that is- were sort of in the same tier as what I was already wearing and just marginally better. But I did free up an inventory slot, so you know I'll take it. No, don't fly yet. Wait until you're out of the damn sea of time. Then we're gonna fly to the blacksmith. And also rest of the freaking inn, because my synergy burn from flying everywhere is starting to be like, I didn't actually rest at an inn when I was in uh, the Shaman Village, so that's part of it, but mostly it's just from flying a lot. Because there's kind of sort of a shortcut you can take to get on into this ocean quicker with the wings, but first of all, it involves a shitload of flying, and second of all, it's not actually that much shorter. Uh, yeah. I wish it was. Is this where I want? It is perfect. I can actually land here! Oh, uh, that's, that's terrific. Of course, I could also just boat up the river. I didn't... I still wish I'd known that so much sooner. Uh, but anyway... Hmm. Now, I probably am not going to sell my, all my equipment yet, because I'm going to have more equipment to sell after I do all of my blacksmithing. It's, it's going to probably take a while. However, before I do that, there's one other thing I can do here, which has been bothering me pretty much every single time I've come here. We possess the power! The power of force! Uh, oh, I see. Ha-ha! Cyclone! Now I can finally get what what's in this box. Whatever it is. I, I really don't know. So... Okay, that is bloody cursed. Don't give me that and tell me it's not cursed. It... Seriously? Seriously! It's a light blade too, so potentially Jenna can use this. You're seriously telling me this is not cursed? Uh, I mean, I'm in a village, so... It's not. Go figure. Then, oh, this is a light blade as well. Um, well that's only plus a, nine. This is plus more than nine. Do you have a light blade there? No, you don't. Okay, we're giving this to Jenna. Uh, where, where did it, yeah, that one. And then the pirate saber can go to... Garrett, I guess? No, the guy blade isn't a light blade either, though. That's only plus two, that's plus two. Right, well, I'm still giving it to you. Is this a mace? No, it's a staff. I can probably do that then. Awesome. You know, that was probably made by the blacksmith guy here. Hmm. Food for thought. Anyway, let's get the forging party started. Uh, start off with... Start off with this thing. Because I don't need to worry about getting something bad from it. Then I'll do the star stardust, and I'll sort of work my way from there. I have I have a lot to get through. I have two salamander tails. I have a, two 
No, I have three Golemars. I have a Stardust. I have the sword I just gave him. I have Dark Matter. Uh, that's... I, I'm listing these numbers, so I'm not actually counting. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have at least eight things. Yeah, cash is fine. It's the Soul Brand. I'm not even going to do a... I'm not even going to equip any of this stuff until I... wait. No, sorry. I Let me save first. No, I said save! Because I'm doing forgeables now. Although, I'm actually not too... I guess I didn't need to do that yet. I'm not too concerned about what... Oh, I forgot about this one, so that's... Okay, you know what? One... I forgot about these. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, including the sword I just did. That's a lot. This thing is the least likely to give me equipment that is currently relevant, so it's a good first choice. Because I don't actually care what I get from it too much, because I'm going to get 11 other things that will almost certainly be better. Not that I've had much Stardust in the past, but I have had, like, a Stardust. So, that tells me it is from earlier in the game. Even though I haven't really had any. Okay, let's look at that planet armor. Uh, I need to actually look at this equipment, so... That's pretty good. Um, it's weaker armor, though. That's, that's sort of what I was expecting. It's unfortunate, but, you know, what you're gonna do. Uh... Not as good as the the cool sword. I guess it makes sense, because you're... Well, I, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Not even as good as your sword, though. That's surprising. Right, well, anyway. Now is when I should be saving, but, you know, we'll wait until I get actually get something back. Because it, it bears repeating. I don't really care about the result of the Stardust all too much. Even though that's great armor, it's still weaker than what I already have. And everything I get from it will most likely fit a similar pattern. Now the Dark Matter, I'm expecting this to give me a cursed equipment, so... I mean, I want to say Weep On. Not necessarily a Weep On, but whatever it gives me, I expect it to be cursed. Because I am pretty sure it produces cursed stuff. Oh yeah, that is, that is so, that is so cursed. Cursed helmet raises attack power. Now that's actually a good helmet. It's, that's a good cursed weep on, or armor, as the case may be. But also, um, I haven't decided for sure who's gonna hold my cursed stuff. And also, it, I want at, I want to get at least two items out of a cursed thing. I'm gonna save though, that's that's pretty good. So right now I only effectively have one. It's the he head slot. I had it before, because the cursed helmet, the crown I have here, is actually pretty good. This thing is a pretty good armor. I mean it's not great, this is better, but it's pretty good. But not good enough to go through the hassle of having to deal with not being able to unequip any of my stuff. So, I think... I want to do this one last, so let's do Salamander Tails. I think I'll do Salamander Tails, and then probably Golem Hearts, and then Dragon Scales, and then the Oracalcum, because I think the Oracalcum is probably going to provide the best equipment. So, it makes sense to save it for the last. Although, you know, I really may as well not even threaten to save scum this stuff, because if we're being honest, I don't really know what I can realistically get. The only thing... I, I don't... Yeah, I don't actually have a good idea what I can actually get from this stuff. Pretty much as long as I don't get repeats of something like, well, like this, I'm gonna be happy. Uh, and yeah, that's better than my current equipment, so it's fine. And even then, two of those would be strictly better than what I already have equipped it. It would just be boring, it's the only reason I wouldn't want it. Plus, well, I, well, yeah, no, that's pretty much it. If, 
Ar armor has a slightly better chance of being able to be worn by more people, and therefore m is marginally more likely to have someone is useful for, but at the same time, if it's not useful in my lead party, I don't really care. And it's going to be two almost no matter- two people only, almost no matter what in that circumstance. Okay, well, that's a robe, that's another spellcaster thing. Raises fire power and resistance. Probably going to give that to Jenna. It doesn't- It's not much better than her current armor. But it does raise firepower, which is relevant. Uh, what what does uh, boost HP? Well, that's not. Water resistance is kind of nice, but it's not really important. Uh, save again because I'm starting a new item, and I have three golem cores. So, you know, one of the, I might actually want to repeat one of these. Maybe a ring that would be nice. All of my rings are kind of junk. Well, no. I have two rings... wait, no. I have three rings that are not junk. I have the Cleric's Ring for cur to use curse items effectively. I have the ring Jenna has, which increases her HP. And I have the Golden Ring, which I believe increases elemental resistance. Every other ring I have, all five of them, are kind of junk. So getting something to replace some of those would be probably nice. Uh, okay, that's a mace. It's better than Isaac's current thing, so it should be fine. Next up, hopefully not a mace. A non-mace would be good. A helmet, for instance, or possibly armor. Summon- also, Summon is not for a spellcaster, because I have been noticing that pattern a little bit. This time, we got... Okay, well, yeah, that's armor. Raises HP, and has good defense value, so it's fine. The final golem core. Then after this is the two dragon scales, and oi. I mean, I'm glad I saved this all for the same time, because it is definitely a huge time saver for me. I'm sort of questioning basically giving it its own video, but you know what? I've been really productive in my videos, so ooh, that's, that's new, and also kind of cool. Uh, but also not very good? Well, I mean, it's okay. It's good enough that I'll keep it, but... I don't know, no matter what, I'm gonna be selling a lot of items, so... I'm not really too p feeling too picky. The only re If I was playing on my own, I might save scum that, but also maybe not. It's certainly not a big enough deal to bother with it in within the context of this video. I just don't really care it that much. There's plenty of there's plenty of good equipment without without trying to get the perfect things from each forgeable. I wonder how much money this is costing actually. I mean, I've I've effectively unlimited money. So, okay, is that wait, didn't I already have one of those? I could have sworn. I mean, it's better than my current shield, so... Maybe not, but I... So, for some reason, I could have sworn I already had one of those. I mean, it's really good anyway, so... It's fine. Wait, no, that is what I think it is, right? I must be just getting confused with something else that is similar. I've never had dragon stuff before, so... Possibly even a dragon shield. Maybe a scale shield. That that would make sense. I could conceivably see my, seeing myself getting have previously having gotten a scale shield that was much the same but with lower defense. 
And now I have two dragon shields. Okay, I kind of I kind of want to throw that back. One is great because it raises water and fire resistance and fire resistance is really important and it's also pretty good defensively. But two of them is kind of useless because I'm not going to give one to Felix here because I want the extra attack power. And it's also boring. So we're going to reroll these. See ya, see ya in a second. Okay. This time, give me something that is not two dragon shields. And man, I don't mind you giving me one dragon shield, but leave it at that. Options are nice. <laughs> and two dragon shields does not really give me many options. <laughs> Especially when you consider it's not even... It may not even be the last shield I get. I mean, come on. <laughs> anyway. What did we get this time? Another freaking dragon shield. I swear, if you give me another dragon shield, I will be out. First of all, I'll be really upset. Second of all, I will probably be cutting out a slightly larger segment. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't come to that. I'd rather just keep this all more or less continuous. Although, I've already sort of ruined that, both by the tra- well, no, I didn't cut out the transit here from Lemuria, did I? But I did sort of have to cut out where I reloaded, so... I swear, this is a dragon shield. Thank you! It's a dragon robe! Completely different! Uh, it's sort of for spellcasters, which... Oh. You know, that actually might be worse than the dragon shield. Whatever, I don't care. I'll keep it anyway. I'm sure I have someone who can use it, even if it's not ideal. Now, this is the one that's important. Because this, I'm, I'm pretty sure you get the best forgeable stuff from this. Uh, possibly accepting cursed things. Auric Alchem and Dark Matter are collectively probably the two best uh, materials for forging items. Probably. So, unless... So... Like, if this was on my own, I would actually just reload this every time until I got something that was... Until I got basically exactly what I wanted. Uh... Having said that... I'll give you this is a very good shield. But I don't want a damn shield. I already have a shield, and I don't really want to replace Isaac's attack thing. And more to the point, this is the only one I have. So, with Cursed Thing it's fine, because I'm going to get other Cursed Weapons one way or the other as the game progresses. Eventually, I'll have a good enough Cursed Weapon to give to someone with the Cleric's Ring, and it'll be worthwhile. That's just sort of the way- if you do any sort of post-game stuff, that's just how it works. But I won't necessarily get a good- but it's a lot harder to get a good non-cursed weapon. There's there's one, but other than it, like who even knows? Uh, okay, that's also not a weapon, but it won't lower my attack power to equip it. So, in fact, it increased my attack power. Oh yeah, no, I'll take that. I will take that happily. So I need to equip all my junk now. Uh, we'll start with Felix and work our way. Don't you dare drop that. And work our way back. This is good for no one except for Garrett, so Garrett gets it. This raises elemental power, and I don't think is good on literally anyone. Nope. Uh. None of these are actually new. Like, none of them. So. Unless I have someone I really want to be faster. Actually, I think I, I was wearing this, but it's, no. This might be... I mean... I mean, we'll do that. We might change it back. And... no. You actually have new stuff! Stuff like, not like corn. Corn is not new. 
Uh, we can give this to either you or you. I'm thinking pro- I'm leaning towards Jenna. Uh, yeah, let's- let's do it like this. Then this I can give to- I can give it to freaking Isaac, actually. Although, he's gonna take the mace, which is better anyway. So, we'll give this to Ivan. Who also has a full inventory. Uh... Sure. Let's do it like that. Okay, yeah, this is better, so we'll give that to you. The robes, now, I would kind of like to put on Jenna as well, because they increase her defensive... They increase her firepower, and she has eruption, which is really good. I mean, this is bait. The, uh... Where, where did it go? The fire boost from this is basically plus two Ginny. Or at least one and a half. So that's fairly substantial. I can give that to you, I guess, unless this is really good. Actually, no, that this is probably... The elemental defense from that is probably better than the small defense increase from this. We'll give this to Maya, then. Who has the... well, that's just sort of bad. Uh, and I still have the Kronos Mail. Which... I mean, let's face it, I'm gonna give this to Isaac. Did I already give the armor, the new armor to you? I don't think I did. What does this one do? It increases your your critical hit rate, but I'd rather have more attack power. Uh, you have the huge sword, which is not better on either of them. I didn't really think it would be. Yeah, like I said, I would have rerolled this on my own. We'll give that to you. You also have the Pirate Saber, which is not good on anyone anymore. You have the Dragon Shield, which is better on Isaac. And I guess technically Felix, but I'm not going to give it to Felix. Uh, sure. Then you can just straight up equip this, I think. And I can give this to Garrett. Or not. I guess this is gonna get thrown out then. Uh, this I need to give to this guy. Cause it's awesome. And this is... Not really better for anyone. It might be better for Ivan actually. Wait, who's faster? Ivan or Piers? Cause that's actually important. Okay, yeah. I mean, obviously Ivan is faster, but more like how much faster. Okay, yeah, we'll throw this to on Ivan then. Since he can do without the agility boost. Uh, I don't think you have anything new. And you just have the cursed thing. And the Assure armor. Hmm. So that just leaves this thing. It is better for everyone, literally everyone except for Isaac. And arguably it's better for Isaac as well, but no. Uh, you still, I still think the elemental defense is better for you. I think the firepower is better for you. So... I guess I'll give this to Piers. And on that note, that still leaves this... Wait, you, were you wearing Erebus armor? I guess you were. I mean, you already have that, so... Okay, we're done! Sorry if that took a while, but... It's, I guess it's good to go through my process like that every now and then. I mean, I didn't do it with... When I did the initial rearrangement, but... That literally took me like an hour. This was... This was like... Five to ten minutes. Anyway, we're gonna live off here. Uh, actually no, I'll show you- I'll show you what we're doing next time. First. Next time... There are a few things we could do next time. We could do Treasure Isle. We could go to do this thing. 
Wait, no, this might be Treasure Isle. I don't even remember right now. Was this, th No, this was not Treasure Isle. Yeah, we could go to do Treasure Isle up here. We're not going to. We could sort of dig around some more villages, seeing what else we can get with the new synergy we have as a crew. We're not going to do that either. Next time, we'll be heading north to Prox. The reason for this is simple. We have, with one possible exception, all of the Ginny we can get without going to Prox. There are, incidentally, six more Ginny to get that we don't have. That is total. Three of those six are in Prox. <laughs> The other three, we, or two of those other three, we need stuff, something from Prox. The very final last field synergy. And the last one is sort of just so far out of the way, that way and so hard that I don't really want to do it until I have everything else. Having said that, I'll join you next time uh, as we prepare to enter the... I see white off the map north. Until then, this has been Kiss Blue with Let's Play Golden Sun The Lost Age, and have a great day. Bye!